Kingston was born um, in April last year. He was born by an emergency caesarean. Ultimately, everything comes down to me in terms of being responsible for Kingston. If he's sick, there's nobody to hand him to. When he's extremely sick, he won't let me put him down at all. I'd love to be able to call or go on an app and then speak to a doctor face to face effectively on my phone and for him to be able to check Kingston out. That would make things so much easier. I think the strategy outlines a really nice pathway for how we can actually move forward in, in digital health and integration of new models of care within our system. My health record is the foundation, if you like, I think, for those new models of care. So before online banking, you had to, you know, turn up at the bank when it was open, line up, wait for the bank teller, and you're quite limited in what you could do. And today, you've got an app, you can control things it's on your time. I see a similar kind of paradigm of what we can start to realise in healthcare too, and that's a pretty exciting time to be here. And that turns the tables on traditional healthcare, because once you give patients control over their data, that empowers them in ways that they've never been sort of empowered to before. It's no longer the doctor controlling the information, it's the patient being a partner in that information sharing. Longer term, having a digital infrastructure allows us to do really special things in medicine, like create really interesting research that looks across the population as a whole and figures out what therapies are working best or where we need to invest in as a health system. I think the biggest barriers are not technical. Everybody puts it in the technical domain. I just don't think that's, that's a problem. I, I really think we can solve those issues. I think it's largely cultural. It's the whole way that we deliver healthcare. It's how healthcare is funded. It's how it's managed. It's the hierarchies within healthcare. They're the things we have to change um, to actually get new models of care into the system. The whole paradigm of healthcare is, is shifting towards preventative medicine. And a big part of that is actually you know, trying to tailor the preventative strategies as much as possible to you and your risk profile as an individual unique patient. The explosion of information, of data and analytics that will come through the next generation of digital technologies will completely transform the way we deliver healthcare.